Hey, it's Dusty Showers from Creepy Creatures, and as you can guess, I'm up on a roof checking out rats. Uh, this rat job has been kind of interesting. Uh, I exhausted all the obvious places where they were getting in, and then we found this. So what we've got here is, so you can see what they do is they come in through here. There's even stains on there, so you can tell that that's where they're coming in. Once they get down in here, what happens sometimes when they redo bathrooms is they cut this pipe off inside. So the rats can go down in here. They literally can climb down there without falling. This one has a bend down just a little bit farther. So they climb down here and when that pipe gets cut off and they don't seal it inside the house, then they have access to go into the wall. And then once they're in the wall, they can typically go into the attic. So it's always a good idea to get these things closed up. Squirrels and rats also love to chew on this. So uh, eventually that can also lead to water damage in extreme cases. And, and this one you can see is actually coming off. So um, you really gotta, you gotta look around, uh, check out everything when you're dealing with rats. Here's a case where they chewed around the outside. And when this is too severe, that leaves a gap where rainwater can go down in there and leave stains on the ceiling. So it's always a good idea to make sure you've got these covered. Rats and squirrels, love them. So if you're in the Tampa Bay area and you're having a rat issue, give us a call. It's our specialty. It's, uh, it's about 80% of our business. We'd love to help you out. Check out creepycreatures.net. And then always be kind to possums and pit bulls. Always. Sit, possum. Sit. Good possum.